Welcome to the Intervention Center at Oslo University Hospital. My name is Erik Fosse. I'm a cardiothoracic surgeon. During the last 20 years, I've been heading the Intervention Center. The Intervention Center is a special department uh, where we integrate at advanced imaging equipment into the operation theaters, thereby uh, offering the patient uh, advanced radiologic imaging like X-ray, CT scanning, MR scanning, and at the same time advanced surgery. We are now in the old part of the Intervention Center. In this corridor we have four advanced suites for treatment of patients. We have one room with uh, angiographic equipment. We have uh, a room with uh, an MRI. We have two operation theaters where we can do uh, image-guided laparoscopic or endoscopic treatment. We are now in the hybrid suite where we integrate advanced angiographic equipment into the operation theaters. This is the control room where the radiology technician can uh, select types of images that we are going to use during the procedures. In these rooms we uh, perform a number of procedures, a lot of cardiovascular procedures. We also do more and more neurosurgical and ENT procedures here. We are now entering the endoscopic suite. In this room, we perform a lot of image-guided procedures. There is no fixed radiology equipment because here we use mainly videoscopic equipment. But you can see the room is quite spacious, so it's easy to use uh, portable x-ray here. We do quite a lot of very advanced procedures in this room, like liver resections, pancreatic resections, and a number of uh, procedures in the lungs. We are now in another operation theater. In this room we perform neurosurgery. The tabletop here can be moved on a cart into the MR, you can see behind me here, into that gantry. Thereby we can perform intraoperative MR imaging uh, during advanced neurosurgical procedures, thereby creating very accurate and very safe treatment of the patients. I think with these new rooms we have come into the future. We have a lot of possibilities here, uh, especially when we are talking about the liver and pancreas. Because we are used to work together with the radiologist, but mostly we have used ultrasound. So this is absolutely new for us to have possibility to use this type of equipment. I also see an advantage uh, to do uh, local ablations, such as radiofrequency, microwave or IRE uh, in these uh, settings. Because you will get a better uh, possibility to, in a way, control your lesions that you create with this type of, of uh, equipment. This is a benefit for the patient not to be moved directly after a procedure to another place to do another kind of procedure, but can all be done in the same place because moving a patient in general anesthesia is high risk. And uh, this means that we can do procedures with the heart, the valve and the aorta all the way. So we don't have any limits on what we can do. We have all the possibilities in the same room. At the same time, this new fusion of technologies, which is enormous, gives us opportunity to perform and develop new strategies concerning the CA surgery. What I mean by that is robotic surgery. Robotic surgery is another era, a new era, completely a new era, which wasn't possible for a couple of years ago. Of course, a robot has to be still guided by the surgeon and eventually the surgeons place the electrode. But this placement is more adequate and accurate with this three radiological modalities which this ORs offer us. These are really the operation theatres of the future, where we can offer the patients uh, the most advanced equipment. We can offer a flexibility that doesn't exist anywhere else in the hospital. Here the patient can get the most modern treatment, every device that is needed. This is also a place where surgeons and radiologists and uh, all types of specialists can work together for the benefit of the patient.